Hey everyone, back by popular demand we have another ASMR page flip and this is I think my second total film page flipping and this is a very good issue. I like this one a lot as you can see and I hope that wind isn't too distracting. It's a very very windy day. Thankfully I've actually already recorded the page flipping itself. I'm just doing the introduction just now um, and it wasn't windy then. But yeah as you can see this is the Star Wars issue. Head of the new Star Wars. And we have lots of delightful things going on in there. So I hope that you enjoy the rest of this video. So in this particular issue we have Star Wars which is obviously a really big deal just now. Yes, I am in my pyjamas. It's quite late at night and I'm all relaxed and really in the mood to do this video. So we actually get kind of freebie. Han Solo, Chewbacca. They are Star Wars, the original top trading card series, volume 1. little bit of light there's annoying. My camera's currently charging at the same time that I'm doing this video and so I can't tilt it too far. I believe he was in Scotland recently. You're talking to me with James Clarifying who I'm not aware of by name. I won't. Whoa. That's Alison Brino. Um, I haven't watched Community in quite a while. Um, so that's quite different. Oh, okay, Pride and Prejudice and Zombies. I read the book about four years ago and I did not. Now I'm a great big Jane Austen fan and I love Pride and Prejudice and I don't like zombies so I don't know. But that's pretty interesting. Gold. Shelter. The best movie ghosts we have. Ringo, The Ring, which I've actually just watched today, but I watched the 2002 version. Nightmare on Elm Street, which I love. Mr. Burton's Bilgeous, which is one of the best films ever. And Ghostbusters, which I haven't seen, but don't tell anybody. I know, I'm, I'm ordering the DVD when I next do another DVD order. It's a, a two-pack with something else. Peanuts movie. I never watched Peanuts as a child. It's not something I get nostalgic about. So I'm not sure if I'll rush out to see that. The Good Dinosaur. I think I'll stick to Land Before Time, but I will see it eventually. I was just about to ask how I'm pronouncing that. Moana. Um, I've heard quite a lot of things, apparently she's a great Disney character, so it'll be good to see how that one pans out. Ah yes, Daddy's Home, Mark Wahlberg and Will Ferrell. I'm really looking forward to this one. When's it out? 26th of December that one's out, Boxing Day. So that might well be the first one that I see. Um, either after Christmas or in the new year, depending on when I get the chance to see it. Which I think would be a good way. 
Spectre, which I know a lot of people have seen. I haven't seen it yet. I'm quite new to Bond. Uh, I've seen a few Bond films. Um, and yeah, they're, they're alright, but I think a lot of the time they're all style and no substance. Which is fair enough, if you like that thing. It's perfectly acceptable, of course. Bridget Jones' baby. It says here. While plot details are scarce, this is about the third Bridget Jones' film, it does seem that the film isn't being lifted from Helen Fielding's third book, Mad About the Boy, which controversially killed off a key character, and I haven't read it yet. So it seems to be set at some point between the second and third novels, with Bridget coming to terms with motherhood. So we'll see. I love Bridget Jones' Diary 1 and 2. So, so psyched for that. I mean, we've still got another, well, 2017, at least another full year and a bit. Depending on what time in 2017 comes out. Bridge of Spies, Steve Jobs. Really not interested in seeing that. I don't know why. I just, it doesn't appeal to me. But eventually, love. Apparently, uh, quite a strong film. <laughs> oh, Johnny Depp, Johnny Depp. Really looking forward to seeing Black Mass, which, at the date that I'm filming this, it's currently the 21st of November. This, uh, It'll be out by the time this video's up. But, uh, yeah. Harry Potter. Now, Victor Frankenstein, which um, I've probably seen by the time this magazine, this, yeah, this magazine goes up. Apologise for the rather severe cuts on this video. My cat is having a mad half hour and it's driving me, it's driving me a bit mental. I'm not sure why. She probably wants fed, but she's just being fed, so she's not getting fed again. Okay, I think she just wants attention. Will Brie Larson be this year's Jennifer Lawrence? I'm fairly sure Jennifer Lawrence is still Jennifer Lawrence this year. Still not interested in the Danish girl. I don't know why, it's just, you know, it's going to be such a massive deal. Uh, it's out New Year's Day and Everyone's going to be talking about it, and I just, I can't find the fascination within me to, to, to be that interested. Not yet, but maybe as the time gets closer, and I've seen Black Mass and Victor Frankenstein and Carol, and I start looking forward to the films of next year. Maybe I'll get into it then. I really liked Inside Out, that film was very good. The film got 5 stars, the DVD extras got 3 stars. Let's see that down there. It's the DVD out, but it's the DVD's out on the 23rd of November. Well, this has been out since August, July. It was definitely out at the beginning of August when I went to Paris, because I remember seeing an advert over there for it. Uh, and I think I'd seen it by that point. I think. Extended edition of the Battle of the Five Arms. 
knock knock. I think that's in my list. Watch it. As is absolutely anything. Um, I can't get my words out. I'm kind of tearing up a bit. It's it's Robin's final roll. And <laughs> quickly moving on. How adorable is that? I don't eat eggs like that. But if I did, I would totally get that. I want my eggs to have a bat out. Hellraiser, I'm desperate to see that. Black cats. I think I just bought that. <laughs> I'm sure I did. Or was I going to when it was out of stock? I don't Brilliant as usual. Tina Jolly, John Depp, Daniel Radcliffe, lots of great films. Yes, thank you for watching this video. I hope my cat didn't disturb it too much. She was asleep for most of it, um, at least half of it. If you have any requests or suggestions for future videos you'd like me to do, just let me know. And I'll speak to you all soon. Bye.